and I hope everyone's doing okay out there. Me personally, I'm 1548 on my way to 2000 where I document my progress by posting a game of me playing chess every single day on youtube.com. Uh, yeah, devastating loss yesterday. Ah, uh, boy, do I want that one back. But today is today, and now is now, so let's see who I'm playing. Nicola Capri, 1968. Nicola Capri, 1968, out of North Macedonia. Playing the French defense. I've played Nicola uh, twice now. Well, no. Four times now. Wow. A win, a loss, and two draws. Queen's Knight variation of the French defense. Uh, let's go here. Uh, I read that wrong. One win, two losses against me, and one draw. <clears throat> so we'll see what today brings. Very closely rated. Nicola Capri is 1559. I'm 1548. If they're going to castle kingside, I want to have my queen here. <clears throat> castle kingside or queenside. Be careful of this pawn. It'll be trapped. So I can either prevent it by just checking now and then pinning or taking, depending on. Or I leave a little escape square. So jack up my pawn structure on the queen side where I end up castling. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw in a check. And then let's see what I need to do. this queen see if they take I'll recapture with my knight okay I think I'm gonna take now jury's still out on what would be the best place to castle Instincts are saying, go for the go for glory and castle queen side. Let's do it. I don't want them to take my bishop. The whole plan of this was to have this identified, but it might not be too bad if I'm able to get my knight into the game as well. So let's, let's see what they end up doing here. <clears throat> Uh, 
Try to be aware of their attack on the king's side. This queen move could they kick my knight out, cause me some trouble. I might think about moving my king to b1. I would waste some tempo though. I just might get my king back over here eventually. Seems safer. Gotta be aware of this diagonal. <coughs> oh my goodness, excuse me. Push this pawn, see what they do. Got five, okay. They're pushing their pawn, they're hoping to do this. And then take, but I'll take here. So let's move this rook up. Definitely got to be aware of this. So I might be, uh, I might be moving my king. Oh, 
or push this pawn. If they take, I can recapture. I just have to move it back here. that F pawn. I still got to defend this pawn. But there's this move. Takes, takes. All right, queen's retreating. Good sign. Excuse me. Spring might be in the air, according to my uh, <laughs> according to my allergies. I push. I take. Well, no. I push. I take. So they take. Figure out how to get to the king. K. 
Okay, now I take, they take, I fork. Oh, no! Ah, the pin of the queen against the king. I did that move so quickly, I didn't even think about it. Uh, that stinks. It stinks, it stinks, it stinks. I wonder who is winning up until that point. <laughs> oh. Is there, a, is there a way still to get there? I doubt it, but. I think my dog needs a Xanax. What a turn of events. What a turn of events. I think I might win this. Let's see, can I draw this? This a recapture. I push the pawn if they are passant. I just keep pushing. And the square will let me promote. Oh wait, if I do this they are passant, then I have to push this one. That's so dumb. I'm an idiot. Ah! Oh. They're just gonna push this one. Oh no!
about it more. I have time. <laughs> Good game. North Macedonia. End games, man. <laughs> Let's check out the analysis. Ugh. I played with 79% accuracy. Uh, pretty close through the middle here, and then I gave it away with a blunder. Um, but they gave it back to a drawable position. Um, but I made another blunder. So yeah, not definitely not my finest game. Uh, I made two blunders, one miss, and three mistakes. So let's see where those were. An inaccuracy out of the gate here with, uh, with the French defense. Should have gained the big center. Um, a mistake here. Okay, interesting. So the queen's knight variation, well, my bishop won't usually be there next time. Because I'll do this. <clears throat> and then if they would have done this, then I would have gone f3. And I would have had this little formation. They might have done this or this. If this, then I can develop. Okay. Note to self, queen, uh, queen's knight variation of the French defense. Um, don't go bishop c4, instead just take the big center. Good move, good move, and a mistake here. Uh, a better move here would have been to retreat back. Um, <clears throat> the reason for that is if I go here, then they can push here. Oops, push here. And if I take, they take, I take, they take, and I lose on the exchange. Um, so in order to avoid the exchange, I retreat back. And then they fork. That's why. So I'm left with this, they take, I take. And then they take here. And then I take here, check, take, and it's somewhat even. Check, check. Good move, good move, good move, best move, good move. Castling was a mistake. The engine liked uh, H3, preventing this, which is exactly what they did, but that was even an inaccuracy. Um, good move, good move, best move, good, best move, good move, good move, best move, good move, great move, good move, best move, best move, and then here we are. The game is even here. <clears throat> They're pushing their pawns. I bring my rook up because I saw this happening and I wanted to defend this pawn over here. Uh, the engine says a better move would to bring the rook over there. But if they did that and they pushed, I would just sneak my king out of the way. And then if they take, I would take back with the A pawn and be none the wiser. I don't know why I said it with that accent, but uh, 
uh, push, push, and then uh, yeah, take, take, best move, best move. These are all best moves. And then here's a mistake that I made that really changed the uh, changed the game. Pushing this pawn. Um, I was thinking after this they would go here. Um, but this was a better move. So instead of pushing the pawn, what could I have done? <clears throat> Reinforce the pawn? No. Queen g3, eventually attacking that. No. What's the best move here? Interesting. Queen c2 is the best. Um, <clears throat> Queen retreats, which is a miss. They could have done that outpost, but... I push, which is also a miss. In this situation, I could have uh, what could I have done? Rook, move my rook here again. Yeah. Is it just because of that? Take, let's see, let's say they move here, they go g3, they go c3, getting an even deeper outpost, queen g2, okay, so it's not super apparent why that rook move is the best. Um, let's assume they do something like this. And then I can push here. And then after takes. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> so the nut, the rook is there to prepare for this move, which they take then I can take this this pawn but then that leaves this undefended so if if I push this pawn they would take I probably recapture here and I keep grabbing pawns and then I attack bishop and just do some other stuff so the miss at this point they should have taken with the pawn if they take with the pawn, that means I take here, and then they, oh. Oh, I did miscalculate that. I miscalculated that. If they take, take, okay. But they should have captured there. Yep. All right, and then here after this mistake, I actually had an advantage. <clears throat> and uh, but I played the blunder of this move, gearing up for the pin. Oh. What a deadly trap they set to, and I made it without even thinking. I moved way too quickly. And so if I had to do it again, I might push this pawn, which is also a blunder. <laughs> uh, because if they push and I take and they take, then they get this passed pawn here. 
that I'm going to have to deal with. Um, let's see. Instead of taking their... Maybe a rook to c2. Whoops. Let's see what's the best move. Where is it? Where is the best move? Where is my... Oh, here we go. Sure, I'll take a hint. Oh, it's moving the king out of harm's way. Is it here? No. Here? Yeah. <clears throat> that allows me to take without getting pinned. Um, and they still might defend either here or here. But that's all I needed to uh, lose this game. Actually, let's see. The end game was actually pretty interesting when I salvaged a way back here. Uh, yeah, that was it. Was surprising when they got their queen out. That was a great move, bringing it back, and it's dead even here. But <laughs> this is so stupid. I. For some reason, in my head, I was calculating them taking and then this pawn going away. <laughs> uh, I made the wrong pawn disappear in my thoughts. Um, so after this, and then if they would have gone here and this pawn had taken away, I would have gone here, they would have gone there, I would have gone here, they would have gone here, I would have gone here. Oh, I already promoted. Um, but if I did this, and did they, yeah, they would have. So from here, instead of that move, I should have just recognized, all right, pass pawn, pass pawn, pass pawn. I need to get over to those pawns as soon as possible. But if I push this pawn, that was the best one to reinforce my past pawn, then there wouldn't have been a way to get to this pawn because this is sealed off and this is sealed off. So I would have been in like, let's get all the way over here mode. And by then, you know, they would have had all of these in tow. And granted, I probably, let's see how it would have played out. Yeah, this, yep, yeah. yep, yeah. yep, yeah. yep. Yeah. Okay, so right here, once it got to this move, they're not going to move their king past this point because my past pawn would win. And I'm noticing they're not advancing any of their pawns. So if in this situation, if they had moved here, I could go here. And then, well, they could go here. And then I could go here, and then that's where we would have a draw. This, this, and then the second they did this, well, no, then I'd retreat, and then maybe this, and then would I push? Yeah, and then they'd check, and then I would win. <laughs> I would go here. They wouldn't be able to move their king, okay. Yeah, or if they went here, I'd win. Not by promoting, because they just go king three here. 
so this and then this it's too late because that's mate i would go king h2 um preparing for this uh well no because i would take so here there's not a lot that they can do if they push i take if they push i take and if they they can't move their king to support so they'd have to go all the way around on this side now i would promote at that point so there there might have been a way for me to sneak out a win if they had blundered in the end game but you all know me and my end games a lot of a lot of ground to make up there so there you have it day 355 in the in the you know on the books uh i'll see you next time